Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor. And I know everybody loves making savings and getting awesome tools which can help you with your next project. And I'm going to showcase a bunch of assets in five different categories because it's Unity's spring sale up until the 8th of May 2024. They have flash deals which turn up every single day. And I've got a web page which keeps you fully up to date and I'll always post down in the community section. So the five categories that I'm going to go over today, full game kits, full character controllers, a bunch of tools across a various different categories, environmental tools, and some environmental packages. And remember, there's so many more Munity assets so which I can't possibly feature, but I wanted to show some of the best that you can find. And if you do navigate to the Unity Asset Store, you can click on the banner at the top, which is the 70% off sale. It will make sure that it will tick sales on and flash deals. You will see the flash deals at the top, which are 70%, 60%, and then any that are coming soon, if it's one that you're after. Or you can actually filter by, say you're looking for 3D, you can tick the 3D tab at the side and look for characters, or maybe you want environments. So you can see what's currently in flash deal, what's in sale, and see the best savings. We've got game kits, and one of the ones which is on the store is the 2D and 3D Infinite Runner Engine, which has been around for a long, long time with a massive amount of customization to make easy, optimized workflows, whether you need this for mobile and touch input to make complete games. It's got loads of built-in examples for entire complete games, loads of assets and classes ready to use. It's really easy and it's got an insane amount of documentation with loads of video tutorials. Then the other one in this example is the TGC engine, which they have got a single player and an online card game creator. This is the online variant for creating your own card game. So it has the structure of a game client and a game server. You can do matchmaking, card collections, leaderboards. You can have it for mobile and desktop user logins and databases and while you're making savings and checking out this be sure to come and support me and get over 225 different scripts and assets on my patreon and there's a massive list in the description too and be sure to wishlist my game left alone rebirth on steam because it would really help me out for the game controllers we start off with the ability and combat toolkit which is one that I actually haven't seen before. So you can create attacks and abilities, weapons and spells in various different styles with nine pre-made weapons, 50 configured abilities and 40 different effects. And it includes a whole bunch of stuff, whether that's swords, guns, hand-to-hand, -hand, bow and arrows, dual weapons, shields, two-handed, air combos, heals, buffs, debuffs, area of effect spells, grenades, sticky abilities. Then we've got one which is more of a generic term. It's the easy character movement too. One of the most robust character controllers that you'll find as it is a kinematic character controller. It's got full documentation. It can take slopes into amount, character versus character interactions, physics, networking, and loads of built-in movement modes, whether you need things like walking, falling, crouching, sprinting, flying, swimming, and over 40 different examples. Got a really popular one here, which is the animal controller, but this one has over a hundred tools that are included to make different states, modes, and stances for all different styles, whether you need this for wolves, bears, dragons, so you can have things for falling, swimming, climbing, different actions and emotes, whether you need this for root motion or in place, and it works with any other character in the Unity Asset Store too. Then I've got the FPS engine, and that does include everything you expect from an advanced character controller with sliding, stamina, wall bouncing, dashing, and anything which includes weapon creations. You can have lots of things for every different ballistic style weapon. It's got a full inventory system, recoil with curves. You can have a pickup, headshot detection. It's got things for footsteps and surface detections, full UI kit for everything that you need for an FPS. So we're going to look at environmental tools. I know a fair few people saw my video on the Crest Water System for the built-in, which is absolutely free, but the URP version is on offer, the cheapest that I've seen it. Whether you need this for lakes, rivers, entire oceans, you can even have boats which have physics on the water. It has a crazy amount of customization because you can change almost every part of the water. If you need yourself a weather system, Enviro 3 Sky and Weather is one that always comes out on one of the most top assets that you can find. Supported across all pipelines with a modular design, it includes dynamic skies, custom lighting, volumetric clouds, even comes with fog and volumetric lighting too, with a full weather system, whether you need that for day and night. This hit the asset store really recently and it's called the Weather Aid Snow and Rain System. This looks like one of the best single systems that you can find for creating shaders and tools 
to be able to actually impact the snow as you walk across it. It is supported across built-in and URP for the moment and HDRP is planned. So it has full snow coverage shaders, rain shaders, terrain support, and you can actually do subsurface scattering and loads of really interesting effects. I've got Microverse, the core collection, which is various other ones from Jason Booth who makes some really, really fantastic creations. And Microverse is the one that I always use because it comes with vegetation, splines, objects, ambience, and more. There is additional kits like the roads, and this is a full, non-destructive, real-time terrain creation system, which requires no baking, no waiting, and no previews. It's all live and editable, so you can actually adjust the geometry and things on your terrain on the fly, and it will morph your terrain around it and works with a hell of a lot of variety. And I'd give a quick shout out to some 3D extensions. Again, you can search the store if there's some specific 3D assets that you want, but Sinti, of course, because they're ever so popular, because they can be used in a variety of games, have their Elven Realm, their Cyber City, and their Apocalypse Collection at a really reduced price across the board, and they have got thousands and thousands and thousands of modular building props. It comes with characters, vehicles, props, and so much more. We're going to look at tools and system which will also help you create things that would take you an awful long time to make by yourself. First of all is the A-Star Pathfinding Project Pro, which is the ultimate solution for creating AI in Unity. Whether you need this for an RPG, an FPS, an RTS, whatever it may be, it supports grid, nav mesh, point, and hexagonal graphs. It's got automatic nav mesh generation. You can have local avoidance, and it's got loads of examples with all the support included, and it does support the burst compiler, the job system, and ECS. Next one is an interesting one called the Easy Build System Modular Building System. It's a nice way to do your own building system, comes with loads and loads of updates. It's got a really quick start in a few clicks with custom editors, demos, supported across all pipelines, and supports a load of the top assets from the store too. Next one is Easy Save, which is always a good one to pick up because it's been around for the longest time and it just gets updated all of the time. So whether you need to do encryption, compression, cloud storage, spreadsheets or backups, a really popular one for those who are creating Steam games, it's the toolkit for Steamworks SDK. And it is a wrapper that uses Unity centric tools to be able to use all the Steam functionality, whether you need that for saving in the cloud, saving on Steam, having controller support, doing leaderboards, and everything that you do, which would take you an unbelievable amount of hours, even a code free way because it's got a drag and drop solution too. Next one, a really popular one also is called Feel, which is the easiest way to improve the look and the feel of your game by creating feedbacks, which allow you to really add a bit more animation and functionality to your game with the need to play that with sound effects, cameras, particles, physics, and you can add a bit of life to everything that you do to the game ideas that you have. I've got one called Puppet Master, and it's an advanced active ragdoll physics complete with ragdoll creation and editing tools from the creators of Final IK. You can animate ragdolls or you can create biped ragdolls in just a single click, you can edit colliders and joints. Got a cool one here called Dungeon, which is a full procedural generation for dungeon layouts, and you can place together with handmade rooms and configurable sets of rules. So you can have this for 2D, 3D, 2.5, top down, first person, anything at all, and you can control almost every single part of the generation. It's because it doesn't have to be random if you don't want, and it even supports its own runtime nav mesh generation, full source code and loads of documentation. The universal sound effects with over 7,000 sound effects, loads of future updates. So the last time was July 23, which added nearly 2,000 new sound effects. And I do actually have a free set you can get over 200 gigabytes for absolutely free and I've got a link down below and you can check out that video. We've got Quantum Console which is a powerful and easy to use in-game command console. By using a simple console command you can create any single command that you want whether you need this for debugging, in-game cheats and it is widely supported across all platforms. It's really, really popular. If you want to increase productivity using AI, there's the AI toolbox with integration for ChatGPT, Wally, Whisper, and Gemini. And it's one that includes all of these directly in the editor. So whether you need text to speech, speech to text, and you can ask it questions, it can create scripts, it can generate code, and even generate images and other content directly in Unity. And we have the Archimatrix Pro, which is a powerful node-based parametric modeling extension for Unity, which allows you to create mutable props and rich environments, but includes really extreme examples to be able to scale and adjust models that have already been created, whether you need to add more levels to a building, 
whether you want to move a turret or a place in a castle to another place it will conform everything around that and you can use splines and other things to really create awesome creations so i do hope that you like some of these assets and i'll leave all the links down below and you can let me know which are your favorites for this sale and be sure to check them out come and join me on patreon support the channel and get over 225 different scripts assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else and also be sure to wishlist my game left alone rebirth on steam because it would really help me out and a massive thank you to peter steiner and everybody else who comes to watch the video so don't forget to like comment and subscribe cheers